So it gives me enormous pleasure to invite you to come and see Spectral Imprints, the Abraj Capital Art Prize 2012. Thank you. Artists are invited to dream larger than they've ever dreamt before, to really lead the world, to be entrepreneurs, and this is what they are awarded a prize for. It's to recognize and empower potential in the region. It was an opportunity for me de mettre en, enfin de donner forme à, à ce projet qui était à, à, à l'étape d'aider. Well, it's just been amazing, uh, you know, working so intensely for six months and uh, traveling and making work and uh, you know completely being immersed in, in, in the process and mentally and physically. First, it's a porcelain vase. It's very easy to invite the audience to it, to come and see it. It doesn't demand so much, but then once you're there, you have to see what's on it, and then you start to question more yourself. For us, this piece is very political because it uh, has to do, first, this email goes through uh, several years, uh, from 1999 to 2012, and it tells a lot about the history of the world, because to be convincing, uh, the scammers uh, place this narration and their emails in places where there are conflict. So, as filmmakers and artists, we were interested in the way that we can make an image of this imaginary. I exhibit a lot internationally in Europe and in America, of course, but I think there is a big difference uh, for me to, to exhibit my work here in, in the Gulf because of this uh, uh, references in my work with the Gulf. Spectral imprints refers to the idea of history and how history actually is taking us from the past into the present and also defines future moments. All the artists that are involved in spectral imprints relate in some way or other to historical narrative. How can we write it? How can we imagine it? How can we produce it? And can we at all relate to history in a way of visual representation? We're extremely happy with the way the prize has evolved. Uh, this is the fourth edition of the Abraj Capital Art Prize. And I think that this year it's really come together in terms of the concept and in terms of being globally acclaimed as one of the most important prizes currently on the global art scene.